Simple attention to bait presentation can be the difference between hooking a fish or going home empty handed. Sure, when the fish are on the job, they'll throw themselves at the hook, but more often than not, they'll be wary of offerings that aren't presented that well. Here are a few ways to improve the presentation of two very common baits, prawns and worms. Always use a hook that is suitable for your target species and your choice of bait. Today we're using a bait holder hook, which is a good all-round choice for bait fishing, as it has multiple barbs along the shaft that will help grip the bait. The age-old question with prawns is to peel or not to peel? The answer really lies in the species that you're targeting. Baiting prawns whole is ideal for large predators that are likely to swallow the prawn whole or attack ferociously, such as flathead or snapper. Peeling is generally suited to species that nibble or suck at the bait, such as smaller brim, whiting or leather jacket. To rig a prawn hole, simply insert the hook into the underside of the tail. Feed along the body, following the natural contours, and then bring it out through the legs. This way, the prawn drifts in a relatively natural state and the hook tip is exposed but disguised by the legs. Try to keep the presentation as even and balanced as possible. Treat nippers or sand yabbies in a similar manner. For peeled prawn, select a piece of flesh in a suitable size for the target species. Feed the hook down through the prawn and ensure that the hook is buried but the tip is slightly exposed. Keep in mind that big pieces aren't always the best option, as they can often discourage fish to swallow the bait whole and rather pick and nibble. However, a smaller size piece that can be easily gobbled down will encourage fish to compete and swallow it without hesitation. This will most certainly increase your fishing action. For worms, it's a good idea to feed the hook through for part of the way and then add multiple folds. That way you get a nice good clump and it should hold onto your hook a lot better. The idea with worms is to create an appealing clump that appears to have multiple appendages dangling from the hook. This clump will appear as an irresistible temptation to fish and is easy for them to swallow. Once again, keep the hook covered in worm and expose the hook tip. Both beachworms and earthworms can be rigged in much the same manner. Remember that putting a little thought and care into your bait presentation can make all the difference in your results. Keep it neat and natural.